everyone doing tonight? Yeah. Awesome, awesome. Well, uh, for those of you who don't know me, I'm Frankie Stiletto of the Circus Freaks, and I am a sword swallower, for real. Um, now, in a little bit, I'm going to get a couple of other circus freaks up here with me. But first, I've got some swords here. Bet you probably guessed what I'm going to do with those. <laughs> now, by a show of hands, because I can still kind of see your silhouettes, um, who in this room has seen a sword swallower besides me perform live? Not bad for the amount of people we've got in this room. Cool. Now, how many of you think that sword swallowing is fake or that there's a trick to it? Because it's okay to speak up. Anybody? Anyone? Bueller? Yeah. Ah, nice. <laughs> hey, all right. Uh, so this is not a euphemism, but do you want to inspect my swords? <laughs> because that's brave. That is brave. Now, and tell us your name, please. I'm Cassandra, and I have turtle power. She's Cassandra, and she has turtle power. Give her a big round of applause. All right, Cassandra, you seem really cool and everything, but I want you to put these on before you touch my swords because whatever germs are on you are going to end up in my stomach otherwise. And I'm going to just hand those to you. There. There we go. And while she's doing that, I'm going to explain how this works. For those of you... Well, we can turn this inside out, can't we? <laughs> I believe in you, Cassandra. Give her another round of applause. She's a little bit nervous. Now that's the only one I've got. I don't have a third one up here. So, for those of you who saw the x-ray in the lobby, that um, is actually a profile x-ray of me swallowing a sword. Um, just in case there are skeptics, I'm, I'm going to rule that out real quick. Um, what happens when I swallow a sword is it's going to enter... Here, I'll just... Demonstration. Not, I'm not going to swallow it yet. Yeah, you have to wait for that. Oh, So it's going to enter through my mouth, unless I'm having a really, really bad day. And then uh, it's going to go down my throat past my pharynx, or voice box. And it's going to travel further down my esophagus, traveling in between my lungs. And right about, yeah, right about here, it's going to nudge my heart slightly to the left. My left, yeah, that's, that's the right reaction. And um, it doesn't stop there. It's going to travel further down within a quarter inch of many, many precious vital organs. And it's going to enter into my stomach. And it's going to find its resting spot inside my stomach, along with whatever I ate about half an hour ago, which was some hummus. So yum. Um, now, with all of that said, Cassandra, I'm going to let you inspect all four of the swords I have up here. Now, I'm going to start with the small one first, not that size matters. So. So, tell me, is there a button? Yes or no? Does it, does it retract? Yes or no? Is it metal? Yes or no? Is that? No, no, and it feels like it, yes. <laughs> okay, all right. So, this is my next biggest sword, giggity. as you can see. Yeah, she says giggity. Um, <laughs> not going to happen, guys. All right, um, same questions here. And you'll notice there's this magical liquid on it that smells a little minty. Um, that's mouthwash. It makes it taste better coming back up. So yeah, it's not an antiseptic of any kind. Same questions for that one. Does it? Is it a trick sword? Is there? Is there a button or is it plastic or anything of that nature? No. No. Like awesome. It. Now, these two are very special, and you guys will see why in a little bit. Double the pleasure, double the fun. Exactly. Now, um, in the meantime, same questions here. Buttons, retractable, rubber, <laughs> anything of that nature. Are these, are these, do these pass your skeptical inspection sure. as swords? Yeah. Okay, awesome. All right, thank you so much, Cassandra. And now, before you go sit down, 
I'm going to let you keep those gloves because you worked so hard to put them on. And I'm going to give you a little signature. Uh, Frankie Stiletto's signature of the Circus Freaks. Sweet. So you I'll get to keep those. Forever. I'm sure you will. I'll frame them. And thank you for not being afraid to speak up in a very large room. Thank you, Cassandra. All right. After I moisturize a little bit, who wants to see me swallow a sword? All right, all right. Well, um, I am going to start with the smallest one because, well, let's face it, we all need a warm up. Now, for any remaining skeptics in the room, I'm going to swallow this sword and I'm going to bow. I want you to pay extra special attention right here, and I promise I'll remove any doubt whatsoever that what I'm doing is real. Okay? Um, for this one, I'm going to need a drum roll and a countdown from five, starting now. Five, four, three, two, one. Let me swallow a bigger one. Sword, a bigger sword. Okay. Oh no, that's boring. All right. Well, good night, folks. Good night. Okay. Now, for this next one, I'm going to take a picture on stage, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to take what I call a sword swallowing selfie which I like to sh uh, shorten to swelfy. <laughs> and I do this with, with some of my audiences, and uh, what I'll do is, after I take it, I'm gonna post it on all the social networks, because, well, PR. <laughs> and uh, I'm gonna post hashtag open stage, hashtag circus freaks. So this is gonna be one of the only times in the show that I'm gonna encourage you all to get your cameras out and take some pictures, and then put your phones away, because we want to be respectful to the other performers. But please, take pictures with me, and post them on Facebook, Twitter, wherever you like, hashtag open stage, hashtag circus freaks. Because the way this is going to work, is I've got my phone up here. Right, right, wait, 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 wait. What is that? Photo bomb. <laughs> no, it'll be cool, come on, come on, everybody, come here, come here, come here, come on. That's well, we'll gang up. It'll be That's awesome. That's a pun. That's awesome. Okay. Sorry. So, it's okay. It's okay. You can, you can be in the picture with your photo bomb. The um, <sighs> way this is going to work, and thank you, lights will help, because I want to get all your lovely faces in the, in the photo with me. I'm going to swallow this sword. I'm going to turn around, and I'm going to take a picture with get all of you guys here. in the background, because this is a really special night. Yeah? We yeah. Yeah. Cool. Everybody? This is awesome. <laughs> okay. Right. Okay, you've got five seconds to get up there if you, if you want to. Okay, cool. cool. Now for this one, I'm going to need another drum roll and a countdown from seven, starting now. Seven, six, five, four. I'll be posting that on the Circus Freaks page, so be sure to go like it. Okay. Give me a cheer if you want a little bit more danger. I can arrange that. Okay. I told you before that these two are really special. There's a reason for that. As you can see, they appear to be custom made so that they stack nicely like that. So, by a show of hands, who in this room has seen a sword swallower swallow two swords live besides me? Yeah, that's about right. I'm going to change that. Now, for this one, 
no funny business, no photo bombs. I'm not gonna bend forward. I'm not gonna do anything besides just get them down because, well, there's a thing called scissoring and it's, well, haha. <laughs> You guys are dirtier than I am. <laughs> Congratulations. So, this is the other, the other form of it, which is bad and does not feel good at all. <laughs> this one is lethal. That's not so funny, yeah. So, I'm going to be extra focused, and I'm just gonna get them down and back up. And you guys are gonna cheer like mad after that, right? When I'm not dead? Cool. So, for this one, let's do another drum roll and a countdown from 10, starting now. inches of steel swallowed at once. <laughs> no big deal, no big deal. Now, I am almost afraid to ask this question. All right, but do you want a little more danger? Yeah. You guys are sick, I like you. So, for that, more danger, you asked for it. I need Alan. Alan! Yes. Big round of applause for Alan Blakely. <laughs> Okay, Alan, they, uh, they want more danger, so I think it's time for the speakers to stop freaking out, and also I think it's time for the Seven Blades Act. Seven Blades? Yeah. Well, you've got four, I've got three, let's juggle. Oh, God. Um, well, Alan, these are kind of dirty. And also, obviously, these are for swallowing, not juggling, let's be reasonable. So, I mean, I can clean this one up, but we still need three more. Hey, Ross. What? Did you bring your knives with you tonight? Uh, yeah, TJ's got them. <laughs> Feel like doing something stupid? Hell yeah! Woo! <laughs> All right. Now, I think we're going to go down here for this part, because, you know, that was a totally organic segue, right? That was awesome. Yeah. Um, go down there. Hi, Space this Whale. This time, we get to endanger the audience. Sweet! Yeah. Now, so wow, yeah. when you turn the lights on, it's way scarier. Space Whale is totally stoked. Whoa. Um, so By the I... way, if I miss all of you, I'm really sorry. Yeah, sorry in advance. So we like to call this act Seven Blades and One Girl. Seven Blades. And, right, <laughs> so, so the goal here, the goal here is that they are going to keep those six blades on the outside of the girl. <laughs> <laughs> and this, meanwhile, is the only blade that will stay on the inside of the girl. That's me. Now this is another one of those terribly dangerous things that, again, if you're, if you're in the audience, watch out. But also, if this works, please cheer madly. And fast, because it's not going to last real long. Let's be real here. Right, right. Oh, and this is another photo opportunity. Feel free to take your phones out for this. Post them on all the social networks, and then put your phone back away. Oh, um, whoa, yeah. <laughs> and no photo bombs. No I, photo my bombs. hands are full. It's we're good. Right. Okay. Are you guys are you guys ready? <laughs> All right. Gentlemen, are we ready? Ready. Ready. Cameras ready.
final open stage. You're a wonderful, wonderful room, and I want a big round of applause for the juggling gents, Alan Blakely and Russ Sherrick. <laughs>